Alright guys, we got a new knife to look at, a honey badger this time, and this one is the HB1101, large black claw. Let's take a look at it. Alright, let's get into the into the black claw. Let's uh, see what we get here. Honey badger don't care. <laughs> honey badgers don't care. Look at all those lovely honey badgers there to choose from. Lots of nice honey badgers. There's even more to choose from actually since since I picked this one up. But uh, anyway, let's take a look and see what we get in the box. It's a magnetic box and there's our knife and there we got a little Torx key there. That's pretty nice. I like that. Peanut's come up here. He's looking for badgers. He can smell them. You smell them badgers, huh, Peanut? Hey, you gonna find one? You gonna find one? All right, Peanut's plonked himself here because he can smell badgers, so... Yeah, anyway, let's have a look at the claw. These things come in small, medium and large. This is a large, as you just saw. Look at that. Pretty cool. Even got a little badger on the clip here. Nice deep pocket carry clip. Super deep pocket carry there. Yeah. I love the honeycomb pattern on these. It looks cool and it gives really good grip too. All right. A few different methods of deploy. Let's uh, let's go through them. Nice jumping on the flipper. Let's do the flipper. Oh yeah, super smooth. Running on ball bearings here, and we can uh, it's kind of thumb flick it. Yeah, cool. Look at that choppy shot, and we can spidey flick it. Spidey flicks like a dream. Look at that. Just drop shot. Alright, let's take a look at this mean blade, this badger claw, and it's in HCR13MOV, and look at that nice deep grind there, super sharp. We've got jimping here, so we can uh, hold it like that for a bit of close-up, close-up work. Super sharp this thing, really is. Awesome. Every knife should be super sharp, shouldn't it, Peanut? Yes. We got jimping up on the back here, jimping on the back of the FRN, fiberglass reinforced nylon handles. We got a lanyard hole, we got a badger logo on here in the middle. Great claw, it's like a. <laughs> You could, uh, if you're gonna fight a honey badger, you, which you don't want to do because they're tough little critters, uh, they'll tear you to pieces. But uh, having a claw sure would help. And if you go on self-defense, uh, I would go for the serrated because the serrated will do a lot more damage than a, than an ordinary blade shape would. But this would be phenomenal anyway. I mean, the, this kind of blade in a self-defense situation, I know a lot of you guys aren't bothered about that, or you live in a country where you're not even allowed to defend yourself, but I mean, you hook onto somebody's hand if they're swinging at you with something, a machete or whatever, you grab that, you're cutting down to the bone, into the bone, you're gonna disable them, that's for sure, 100%, if you get a good swipe with this thing. Uh, not much for stabbing, but for slashing. Man, this thing it takes some beating. Great big hole here. Awesome for for flicking open. Just run so smooth. Centered, perfect. I'll put the weight up on the screen. Let's check some dimensions. I do have a ruler here. My trusty ruler. So the, what are we at here? So that's what it is closed, which is just a, over four and a half inches closed. But, uh, let's check the blade. They say this is a three and a half inch blade. And there you go, it's just, just short of three and a half inches actually. 
and the cutting edge is just over three inches of mean claw. Comes from a blade stock which is about three and three quarter millimeter. So you know we're push knocking on the door four mils blade stock here. And down at the point, down at the pointy end, about one and a half mil. Look at that point, let's take a look at that. That is really strong, that's a strong point. Yeah, I like this. This is a beast. All right, just want to keep it short, quick look at it. Open construction there, FRN backspacer. Steel liners and they are milled out for lightening to make it nice and light if you can see in there yeah cool jump in here on the lock release look at that just fall shut all right catch you later guys have a good one mm -hmm.